hi friends welcome back to my youtube channel hope you guys are doing well i am going to talk about uh, you are on model pop up in this video so i am going to take one use case on the problem record what i am going to show you that if the problem record is closed then one ui action why ui button out of box ui button will be appeared on the form that is reopen so that it will give you the provision to reopen the record once again and when uh, you are trying to reopen one existing problem closed problem that time it will check that uh, it will making the work notes mandatory and it will check whether you entered the work notes or not if you don't enter the work notes it will not allow you to reopen the problem so it will prompt with one dialog box that enter the work notes once you enter once user enter the work notes then it will save that value pass the value from the dialog box to the work notes journal, journal entry and it will allow you to reopen that existing problem so as you can see here first i am creating one ui page to do that and this is my html section where i am forming my um you forming my dialog box and in the client script i am going to put the logic so i already created one script before making this video that is one function continue ok so i am pasting it here and as you can see and i am trying to put the comment as much as i can so that you guys can understand so as you see uh, in my uh, in, in in the html part i formed one dialog box right so in the dialog box user enter their work notes and they have a button called ok when you click the button then it will call this function this client script this client script so these clients what this client, client script will do it first check that um, whether work notes are empty or not if it is empty then it will um stop the submission and then in the second part line number 11 you see that i put a comment that if the work notes are not empty so once you enter the value in this dialog box and hit ok and um, work so work notes are already there then it will destroy that dialog box so the dialog box will be closed and um, uh, submission will be done and it will allow you to reopen the record once again so if you wanted to build your same type of functionality in your pdi or your uh, in based on your requirement you can just um, you can just pause the video and you can check like what are the comments i put uh, line by line so you get an idea so what each line of coding uh, is formed and what exactly it is doing and as you can see that um, here i need to select one um, one user role so for which users this uh, ui page will be work so i am selecting snc under, underscore internal that is how 
these dialog box should look like. Now let's go back to the problem record. And I'm going to the UI action, that reopen UI uh, font button UI action. So this is the reopen UI action as you can see and script is already there. So what I need to do from this reopen UI action I have to call my UI page. So as you can see line number 12 here I am calling my UI page through this glide dialog window function. So based on your requirement you have to create similar type of UI page um, and then you have to embed that um, embed that UI page in your UI action uh, script. So I am going to save this UI action, reopen UI action and I will go back to the problem record and I will show you the end result. So as you can see this problem record is resolved. But what happens that resolve if a problem gets resolved that reopen will not be appeared on the form it has to be closed. So let me open that problem. So now the state is closed. So now it is closed and you can see one dialog box has been uh, appeared on the phone and I enter my work notes and once again I hit the reopen. Now this problem record has been reopened and state is assess. So that is what we covered in this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much.